Listen and practice. I used to eat out a lot, but I don't eat out much anymore. All the good and expensive places near my apartment have moved or gone out of business. Now there are only really expensive restaurants in my neighborhood. It's really too bad. Listen and practice. In Los Angeles, you have to drive everywhere, and sometimes the traffic is terrible. But that's the only bad part. There are a lot of fun things to see, like Hollywood, Disneyland, museums, and movie studios. Listen and practice. I think Rio de Janeiro is one of the most interesting cities in South America. The nightlife is great. They have great musicians, so there's always good music in the cafes. Crime is a problem, though, so you have to be careful. Listen and practice. My trip to Cancun this summer was great. The thing I liked most was going snorkeling at the beach. The water was crystal clear and full of the most beautiful tropical fish I've ever seen. I'll never forget it. Unfortunately, though, I spent too much time in the sun and I got the worst sunburn of my life. I had to go to the doctor to get a cream for it. Next time I go, I'll use sunscreen every day. Listen and practice. One day, a rich dad took his son on a trip to a village. He wanted to show him how poor someone can be. They spent time in a farm of a poor family. On their return from the trip, the father asked his son, how was the trip? It was great, Dad. Did you see how poor people live? The father asked. 
Oh yes, said the son. So tell me, what did you learn from the trip? Asked the father. The son answered, "We have one dog; they have four. We have a pool; they have rivers. We have lights at night; they have stars. We buy foods; they grow theirs. We have walls to protect us; they have friends. We have television." They spend time with family and relatives. The boy's father was speechless. Then his son added, "Thanks, Dad, for showing me how poor we are." Listen and practice. I went to Mexico City for the first time last summer, and I managed to use my Spanish every day. I mean, I still had to look up words a lot, but I was really proud of myself. The only bad experience I had there was when someone stole my purse while I was having lunch in a restaurant. Next time, I'll watch my purse more carefully. Listen and practice. I really enjoyed my visit to London. I wish I could have stayed there for a month instead of just for a week. The thing I really enjoyed most was the British theatre. I went almost every night and saw some really famous actors. Unfortunately, I didn't realize how expensive London can be. I spent twice as much money as I had planned to.
Listen and practice. You wouldn't believe what happened on my vacation to Bangkok. I lost my wallet in the taxi. I thought I would never see it again. But that evening, the taxi driver came to my hotel and gave my wallet back to me. I was so relieved. The last day I was there, though, I got food poisoning from some fish I had at a restaurant near my hotel. Next time, I'll eat at a different seafood restaurant. Listen and practice. It used to take me about an hour to get to the airport, but now it takes me more than two hours. There's so much traffic here these days. Listen and practice. October 31st is Halloween. Children wear costumes. In the evening, they knock on doors and people give them candy. At Halloween, some people buy a pumpkin. They cut holes in the pumpkin to make eyes, a nose, and a mouth. They put a candle in the pumpkin to make a lantern. A lantern and a scary face. Stores sell Halloween toys, like skeletons and spiders. People aren't really scared at Halloween. It's fun. Listen and practice. New Year. All around the world, there are big festivals for New Year. People in different countries do different things. In Spain and Portugal, people eat 12 grapes at midnight. On December 31st. In Japan, 
People like laughing at midnight. They say, start the year with a laugh, then all the year is happy. In Thailand, people throw water in the streets. They have water all over them, but it's not a problem. The weather in Thailand is always hot at New Year. At New Year, many people watch fireworks. Little children sit on their mother's or father's shoulders so that they can see the fireworks. The fireworks go up, and all the people say, Happy New Year! Listen and practice. New Year. All around the world, there are big festivals for New Year. People in different countries do different things. In Spain and Portugal, people eat 12 grapes at midnight. On December 31st. In Japan, people like laughing at midnight. They say, start the year with a laugh, then all the year is happy. In Thailand, people throw water in the streets. They have water all over them, but it's not a problem. The weather in Thailand is always hot at New Year. At New Year, many people watch fireworks. Little children sit on their mother's or father's shoulders so that they can see the fireworks. The fireworks go up, and all the people say, Happy New Year!